Okay, uh, I am Colin, and I come from China, the Institute of Zoology, Chinese Academy of Sciences, and I'm working on the catalog of Lab China, and okay. I want to try, try this. Okay, it works. And, <clears throat> and today I want to talk about taxonomy data quality control for catalog of Lab China. <clears throat> and this is the outline. And uh, firstly, I <clears throat> want to tell about the catalog cell of China, and I will go through this part quickly. <clears throat> and next is about data quality control. And finally, is about our plant and the next step. And uh, checklist of species is important, as all I've said just, and it have answering uh, what and how many species we have in a country or a region. And high quality checklist of, of species are often used as platforms in biodiversity databases for indexing and different species data. And also the CBD also require high quality data and available data. So, so uh, our purpose of Cell China is to uh, collect and integrate data of species distributing in China and to produ produce authoritative and high quality checklist and pro provide free services to users around the world. And Silver China was published annually and updated uh, diametrically through website and standalone application. And this is some milestones about uh, uh, Silver China. In 2006, uh, Species 2000 China Note was founded. And two years later, we uh, released the first version of Silver China. And we launched the new version of Silver China in uh, 2017. And in 2019, the Silver China include uh, over uh, 100,000 species. And now we reach the 16th version in 2023. And this is all the cover images about all the uh, annual versions. And oh, there is an image cannot display, it, but I want to say it, uh, it includes now uh, over 135 species uh, in two, uh, 2020, 2023 uh, version. And Seoul China was released through website and a standalone app that like you can uh, just just don't need an uh, internet and through API for services. And so China was uh, widely used in China now, and uh, it was cited about more than 1,000 one times in different uh, publications. And it was adopted and recommended by government um, department as scientific formal scientific database Basis. And we also have local government to build their own checklist uh, for protection. And yes, uh, many institutions and universities, companies also use our checklist, just like the, the last one, the company TikTok in China, they use the checklist to uh, push their project about the citizen science. Yeah. And, <clears throat> and so China is popular. One of the most important reasons is the high quality. And we have several measurements for data quality control, like we select reliable data sources, and we use uniform data standards, and we have tools for species data management. And over 300 taxonomists and specialists in, are involved in the, this program. And uh, I compared the soil uh, China uh, with sell uh, of all the data items. Most most of them are the same, but some are special for soil China, like 
Chinese formal name and the Chinese pinyin for the Chinese name. And this is the species page in Sierra China and Sierra. Uh, most are the same, but uh, we Sierra China includes some data uh, in Chinese. Okay, this is the workflow uh, for harvesting data from many single species data bases and into a bigger, like including animal, plant, and micro organisms, and then we build the catalog like China annually to release a store website and stand alone the APP to public. And we have a species data management system that have people to work together to uh, work on the same uh, test group or uh, different test group. And we also uh, develop a function to uh, upload species data through an uh, Excel file or MS Word file. And we label the, yeah, this is an example. We uh, have some labels for tag the document, and then it can be extracted directly in, uh, from the document and import into the management system. And also, you can collect uh, multi dimensional data or species, not just for the uh, cell China. And we also uh, have a visualization tool for taxonomy trace and management, like drag drop is simple to use. And we also to compare different uh, taxonomy uh, trees to find the difference. And then we can, yeah, okay. we, we can see the, where is the difference and how to integrate different sources together. And this is another one to compare uh, the galliforms from CLL and CLL China. And yes, most of all the nodes, test zones are, look, are common. And all the, all the data are uh, checked by, confirmed by experts online in the species data management. And this is the <clears throat> process of data checking before um, publishing annual uh, catalog of life China, including 28 steps. Uh, uh, so I can say that, uh, include checking scientific names like um, to delete the special uh, characters, revise uh, misspelling uh, words, and so on. It's about the scientific names. And we also <coughs> have to revise wrong the pinyin for the polyphonic character uh, Chinese. And this is the, the change, the uh, revised the pinyin. And uh, this slide shows we, uh, we use AI have extracting distribution data uh, by the natural language process. Okay. And after we <coughs> integrate all the data, we uh, assess the quality of each species from dimensions. And you can see that this, this species is uh, complete and this, some, this species has some uh, information, uh, that lack of some information, and this is also. And next step, uh, uh, the gaps of cell China is large and especially in insects and uh, fungi and virus. And so the first thing is to fill the gaps is our major task in the next step. And I brought this <coughs> figure from Sierra, uh, uh, Global Sierra. Uh, so we seeking for the cooperation on building Chinese bank uh, for China. And we can join this checklist bank and we have upload our Sierra China into the uh, checklist bank. And <clears throat> another thing is about checking test on concept uh, because we have many data source, we have many checklists, but uh, 
different te testing concepts uh, of fact its uses in many situations. So we need to check in testing concept. And it's all about my uh, presentations. And I want to thank to Swiss 2000 and leadership of CLR for their help on building China Node and CLR China. And thanks to editorial board and channels who involved into this work and thanks to organizers of Simulation and Conference for their excellent job. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. <laughs>